<laughs> hey, what do you think you're doing here? Don't you know this is private property? <laughs> Listen, you don't have to give me sass about it. Just get out of here before I call someone. Okay? You're gonna make me do this the hard way, aren't you? <laughs> Listen, kid. I'm not one to mess around with. My name's Spike. Spike Spiegel. If you didn't know... I could turn your ass into the police anytime I want. So, I suggest not to get smart with me and tell me what you're really here for. Mm hmm. We're just sneaking around to see what you could steal. That's not very smart of you, kid. Something like that could get you killed around here. <sighs> I can't blame you. I was young and stupid like yourself. So I understand what you're going through. Well, not completely, but I think you can get the drift of what I'm saying. Have a seat with me. Let's talk about it. So, I'm guessing you grew up in a rough place. Not much food to eat on the table. So you had to scatter around, looking for any little bit of money you can get, just to get that little bit of more food up on your plate. Mm-hmm. Grew up in the slums, didn't you? <sighs> yep. It's always those type of stories. It makes me laugh because, you know, I kind of grew up in the slums myself, but I was smart. I knew exactly how to get the hell out of there. You're not at that level of intelligence as of right now, but with the right teaching, you can get out of there. Listen, kid, I've been through a lot more than you think. I've gone through shootouts. I've gone through robberies. Hell. <laughs> I even lost a few things. You don't think I lost anything? All right. Look me in my eye, kid. This eye is not a real eye. I lost my eye in a shooting accident. I feel like I'm seeing the past, but also the present at the same time. So. You really think I didn't go through anything? Next time, think before you start speaking. <laughs> That's all right. I've told that story like once or twice, and it usually scares the hell out of people. But I, I can tell you, I am uh, still the same man I was back then. So, let me ask you a question, kid. Why are you stealing? Well, I know it's besides the point. Tell me why, why you're actually stealing. You doing it for fun? Profits? For a family member? Bingo. Hit your heartstring with that one, didn't I? 
Yep. Always doing something crazy for a family member. Are they sick or something? Hmm. Here, have a smoke. Put some hair on your chest. Oh, come on. What happened to your big and tough attitude all of a sudden? You don't smoke? <laughs> Fine, more for me, I guess. Hmm? Oh, I see. Well, good. I gotta tell you something. The world is a uh, pretty crappy place. And the people on the world are a lot more crappier. You're not gonna know what you run into sometimes. Sometimes you run into people like me who don't really care what you do. Sometimes you run into people who will lead you down the right path. And sometimes you run into those bad people who will end up shooting you dead or stabbing you where you stand just because you looked at them funny. So, did I give you some good advice or what? <laughs> there you go, kid. Now quit trying to steal around this neighborhood because there's a lot of people who are the bad type of people around here. You're lucky you ran into me. <sighs> now, I live in the present of life. That's why I'm so calm with everything. I don't try to Reminents about my past that I don't try to look forward to the future. I look for what's in front of me. And that is the present. Nothing more, nothing less. And I'm kept with that. You should probably take my advice, kid. You know, save you in the long run. Hmm? <laughs> uh, I know you're going to ask that. All right, let me see what I got. I think that'll be enough for you to get a few meals for your family. Here, take it. Yeah, no problem. Now, you go run along now. Try not to cause any more harm around here. And we don't have to run into each other anymore. I think that sounds like a fair trade-off. Don't you? Good. Now get going before I change my mind. <laughs> These kids always getting into something. And for what? Just for a simple dollar. Reminds me of when I was a kid. Do anything for a dollar. Just so I have something to eat. Uh, 
Anyway, I need to go buy more cigarettes. I'm getting low on my pack. All right. Oh, we're sitting in a store. <laughs>